Hello, my name is Tom Stiles, and this is Tom's Radio Room Show number 52. Yep, 52, and made it to 52 this year. Hoped I would get more in, but since I went back to work, I haven't had much time to do the videos I'd like to do. But the good thing is, uh, we're going to be uh, shut down at work for a couple weeks, so I'm going to try to catch up on my videos during the um, during the holidays. Speaking of holidays, uh, this show, I want to show you my wish list for Christmas, the things I would like to get for Christmas. And maybe I'll send this video to my kids to give them some hints. Although most of these things that I've got on my wish list are just that. They're just wish, you know, if I win the lottery, I'd get them. But they're way, a lot of these things are way out of my price range, but some of them aren't. And uh, so I would kind of like to show you what my five to ten top items that I'm hoping for for Christmas. Here we go. Okay, for this show, I'm going to show you five of the things I'd like to see under the Christmas tree related to amateur radio or scanner radio gifts. The first one I'm showing you here is something that I've always wanted is a software defined radio and this is an example there are lots of these out there they range in price from $150 for a PC board that you supply the power and everything for to $2,000 which is totally um, including everything you need including power and everything and this is just one example this is the SDR IQ SDR radio and the beauty of the SDR radio as I had shown in one of my previous shows is that most of the typical radio is uh, simulated in your computer so it gives you a full control of the filters and everything imaginable um, and you can do what you want to do as opposed to having it all fixed in a radio that what you buy is what you get. Uh, this particular one sells for $499.95, and it uh, comes in an enclosure and uh, comes with uh, a um, connection to connect it to your USB, and then the software talks to it via the USB. So this is uh, one of the things I'd like to see under my Christmas tree this year. Not particular, like I say, not particularly this one, but maybe one like it. Okay, the next item, <clears throat> it's not a new item. It's been around for a while, <clears throat> but I've always considered it a nice radio. And I had a, <clears throat> excuse me, had a friend of mine who has one of these. And um, I saw it and I really liked it. This is the Yezu FT450D. Uh, the thing I like about it, even though it's somewhat of a compact HF VHF transceiver, it doesn't take up a lot of desk space, but it has a nice big display like you see here. The readouts are nice and big. It's easy to use. It has a lot of uh, features and uh, it's got a lot of good write-ups on it. This particular model is um, $1,340. That's retail, and where I'm at right now, which is Universal Radio, it's on sale for $4.94. So this is another thing I'd like to see under the Christmas tree for me for Christmas. Okay, now, the next item is the ARRL handbook that's been around for years. And I would guess the one volume that I have that is most recent is probably 1997. So you can see I don't have anything up to date. Um, and uh, the, they've gotten kind of expensive to say the least, but it's got a lot of information, especially if you're new to ham radio. So this is a great book to have. Um, they're now about $45, depending on whether you get the soft cover or the hard cover. And it's just a wealth of information. It's a huge book. I don't remember how many pages, 
but it's thousands of pages. All the information you could all, ever want about ham radio. So that's my next item that I would like to see under the Christmas tree. Okay, moving on to scanner radio. This product, again, has been out for at least a year. Um, when I first saw it, I was really excited about it. And again, um, the price is up there. Right now it's on sale for $489. I think when it first came out, you had to pay full price, which was like $600, and everybody was charging full price. But it's been out for about a year. And this is, a, if you're not familiar with the Uniden Home Patrol radio, it's, um, it's a scanner radio. It does trunking, and everything as far as setting it up and selecting the channels and everything is built into the radio. And you have, you don't have any knobs or anything. Everything is done on this touch uh, screen. And you go in, and, and they've got the database. The database comes from the radioreference.com website, and you can update it. Uh, so that you're already always up to date. But this database is stored in this radio. Once you download it, it has one initially, and then you can update it. But once you download that database is in there, and it's just like being on the website. You can go through to all the different uh, states and everything and pick whatever uh, channels you want to monitor. Also, you can do that automatically based on your position. Um, so if you... If you um, are traveling or do a lot of traveling, this scanner will update automatically uh, to the particular location you're at. Or you can enter a zip code and it will show you uh, the uh, radio things that are on. No, no, Foxfire, I don't want an update. Oh, okay. Anyway, as I was saying, I'd love to have this radio play with it. I've got, as you well know, I've got a lot of scanner radios but this is the new kid on the block it would be a great toy for us big boys and uh, like I says it does do trunk tracking and uh, it does also do digital which I do not have a radio that does digital so that would be nice to have so anyway that's my next choice for what I'd like to have under the Christmas tree now moving right along about antennas uh, I do a lot of shortwave listening, and I am a ham, so I can use a good external outside antenna. I have have uh, a couple, but they're quite old, like me. They're quite old and probably need to be replaced. Well, they need to be replaced probably is not the right word. It's probably they need to be replaced. So I've always uh, wanted to, to try out one of these Alpha Delta X DX Ultra antennas. That is good for uh, 500 kilohertz to 30 megahertz. And uh, I'll go back up here. Again, it's a little pricey, $158 on sale. But um, I've heard a lot of good things about it and would like to try it out. Another good item to go under the Christmas tree. Okay, I was going to show five items and here's my, uh, that's my five items. Uh, possibly I'll do another show uh, with five more, and uh, hopefully this, uh, you'll enjoy this show. But anyway, I want you to have a uh, happy holiday, and uh, enjoy Christmas, and hope some of you get some of these great big boy toys under your Christmas tree. Bye-bye.